Hey everybody, it's Innocent here. It's the month of April 2020 and here are my top 5 apps that you might want to try and install. Before we dive into the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and without any further ado, let's jump right into the video. So starting off on the list today is called Clipboard Actions. Just like the clipboard in most Android apps, this particular app saves the text that it copy from different sources, from your social media handles through to any other place that you can copy a text. But then this particular app has some more advantages to that particular clipboard that we have. The first is it doesn't get cleared off after some few days or when your phone is restarted. So you realize that I copied a text about two weeks ago and this particular app still has the test anytime i want to go back and then recopy that particular test you can just use the copy sign over here and then it copies it to the clipboard action also you have a couple of activities that can be performed over here you can share it straight away using the share button you can also use the translate the inbuilt translate that has been made for it so if this is a kind of test that you want to translate you can just use the translate here and then it translates for you the speak button over here also read the test to you in a very clear voice what makes this app even more interesting is the fact that you can back this one up so you can back and export the data to your google account or let's say you can share it on a bluetooth or via whatsapp as a test so that anytime you change your phone you can just download the app and then you can import the data file that you exported over so your tests that you copy are secured you can use them as long as you want i think this is an interesting app that you might want to check it out so coming up at number two on the list is called podcast addicts if you are someone like me who is recently getting himself into listening to podcasts and a lot of audiobooks this particular app will be the one best app for you because it is an integration of podcast and audiobooks it is actually categorized into podcast and audiobooks and what makes this more interesting is the fact that some kind of youtube links not all youtube videos can you access from this app but some kind of youtube apps are linked to this particular app so you can just watch them out and the categories even makes it more simple and easier to find your podcast so when you click on the top audio here which of course is the podcast you can see from all the categories and then it has been categorized such that you can search from your audiobooks straight down to news and music you can search from the trending to whatever is new and then to the top video over there as well even more on the categories has been grouped over here such that you can click on any of your favorite example technology over here and then you can listen to all the audiobooks and then the podcast from technology on this side of the app i think this app is a beautiful app that integrates your audiobooks and then your podcast if you're someone who is looking for a two-in-one app like this i think you should definitely give it a try next on the list is called tag work so this particular app is a simplified app that helps you to choose captions or hashtags for your image it uses the ai feature to create a kind of hashtag for a particular image but then that wasn't really much of an experience that i had because i don't think it gave me the exact hashtags that i needed to use for this particular image but then you can realize that it uses the ai to detect some few things or words or like colors something like that and then it gives you a particular hashtag or set of hashtags that you can use but what works the best is the captions over here and then the hashtags so you can browse from the category over here any one of them that you want say business you want some nice captions for your business post or you're posting something on business you can just come and copy one of these ones over here and then use it as your caption it works pretty fine and then the hashtags also works pretty fine something like family you can get a great list of hashtags on family that you can easily copy and paste it in your hashtags if you don't know hashtags are one of the best ways to build or grow your instagram handle or instagram account so you can use any of these hashtags for free one thing that i like about this app is the fact that you don't have to sign in or give them your credentials before you can use it you just have to download the app 
hop onto it and then you can use any of these captions and hashtags for free next on the list which happens to be number four is called voice notes this simple app with a simple user interface helps you to take notes with your voice it is pretty simple with this simple user interface you can simply click on the speaker over here and then it starts taking your voice but if you don't want to also use the speaker it still has some test that you can use to take your notes i think that is pretty fine that you can use over there so let's see how this particular speaker let's see how best it works so this is a recording of the 2020 apps i believe this particular apps work very fine especially when you are not speaking that fast when you are speaking one after the other as i'm doing right now yeah i think it's got a couple of them so you can just use this particular app to use your voice instead of writing your notes if you are in a meeting you can set this one close to you and as everybody speaks it picks up the test and then it transcribes it for you simple and super easy to use the last app on the list today is called family wall these times that almost all of us are staying home one of the few things that we can do to check up on our family members is to get in touch together this app is created for you to hang out with your family or stay connected with your family it has a bunch of features i can't explain it all but you might want to download this to explore further first is it helps you to create a ton of lists that you can share with your family members so one of you would definitely have to create an account and invite the rest to join the group and then you can create a list of things that you want to do or achieve as a family you can share calendar together you can even start a chat here so you're going to have something like a family chat not outside of this app so anybody that you invite to join the conversation you're going to have a separate chat as a family over here you can even plan meals together and you share galleries together this is a beautiful and interesting app that you might want to give it a try the one feature that makes this stand out is the ability to trace any particular family member where they currently are so if you invite one person to join you can even track their location as to where they are currently and whether they are safe or not all they have to do is to put their location on so that the other family members can easily trace them it comes in a free and then a premium version the premium version gives you additional functions and options to choose from unlike the free version so if you want to keep your family and yourself intact you might consider downloading family wall and that wraps it up for this episode of the five best apps that you might want to try every single month let me know in the comment section which one was your favorite which one you are considering to download and which ones you would want me to cover in the next episode or the subsequent episodes of this types of videos thank you so much for sticking around to watch this video please don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one it's innocent here and bye